YouTube. How are you? Um, I'm coming to you because uh, I just wanted to let you know that I just got done doing my twist. As you can see, um, it's curling up on the ends, which is something I'm loving, which let me know my hair is back to that healthy state. No heat, no heat, no heat, no heat. Um, this is how you know you have heat damage. If your curls are not all the way down to the ends of your hair and your hair is straight on the ends, you have heat damage. If it's curly up here and then down here is straight, you have heat damage. The only way to get rid of that heat damage is either stop using heat, do protein treatments, or cut it off. In my case, I caught my hair in time when I figured out I was just using too much heat in my hair, too much blow drying. Um, it, it was not healthy for my hair at all. So do not use too much heat in your hair, your children's hair. Um, I say in your children's hair like once a month or twice a month. Other than that, don't put any harsh chemicals in their hair, um, relaxers, um, at the age of seven, eight, nine, I got my first relaxer at, I believe I was 13, 12, and my hair, when I tell you it was long, I mean, it's, it's a nice lens now, when I blow dry it out, it's very, it's, it's like this, but, um, as a young girl, my hair was very, very long, even in what it is now. So, I know that if I go back to that regimen of when I was young, every strand that was lost will be rebuilt. Um, so, if you had long hair growing up, that hair can come back if you go back to that regimen of what used to be done. And what used to be done on my hair was just um, ponytails, uh, using the grease and the oil to keep it moisturized. I, uh, I think I got my hair pressed like every, I say every four weeks or every month, something like that. It wasn't pressed every day. So um, using too much heat is not good for your hair or your children's hair. Like I said, this is a style that I am going to be um, wearing, um, for a while, uh, I'm going to wear my wigs, of course I love my wigs, but even after I, um, wear my wigs, I'm going to make sure my hair is moisturized underneath the wig, but no more heat for two years. So two years, um, I say 2018, by God's grace, I will blow dry it out and see the healthiness of it at that time, but 2018, is when I will put heat back in my hair by God's grace. Um, as of now, I will not use any heat at all. I only wash my hair once a week now. I used to wash my hair every day, which was not a good regimen. But because of the curly texture I have, it just seemed like the oils would just be too much. And, and I felt like I just needed to wash, wash, wash. But that wasn't the case. Um, so I, I've started a new regimen. And I only wash every Saturday. Every Saturday, I will do a deep condition. And then also, I'll do, I'll do a shampoo first uh, with um, hydrated um, shampoo. And then I'll do a deep condition. So, it's not good to wash every day. So, I'll leave this video with you. And um, just wanted to show you the texture of my hair. And also... That my hair is very healthy. Um, it's curly on the ends, which, you know, um, I've seen before I started doing this where my hair was straight on some parts.